Welcome back. The highly anticipated season 14 of The Real Housewives of New York City almost here. Got a brand new cast. Andy Cohen, of course, our friend, executive producer. No stranger to the hit shows, nearly two decades worth of drama. We got Jenna Lyons here. She is the former president and creative director of J. Crew who can now add the title of Real Housewife to a resume. <laughs> Andy, Hose. season 14. Season 14. Okay, how does it feel? Like, is, is every season like, oh, my gosh, it's a new baby. Well, Here this we really go. is a new baby yeah. because we've taken a beloved member of the Housewives franchise yes. and totally rebooted it <laughs> with a group of fresh, energetic, yes. fashionable, aspirational, brilliant women. Jenna at the forefront. Uh, Jenna, <laughs> How did you of get course. Jenna to do it. Well, it's kind of incredible. I mean, look at him. We had a couple, How could I say no? We had a few <laughs> long conversations, yes. come to Jesus conversations, yes, as yes. they were. And Jenna went in for the trust fall, and I'm so glad she did because she is a brilliant. Real Housewife, and the show is wonderful, and it's fun to watch. And I think for people who've always loved the Housewives, yeah. this gives people what they love about the show. But it's yeah. fresh and new. It's dramatic. It's funny, and it's New York. So everyone has a vibe about them, Jenna, yes. um, on the show. Yes. Some sometimes there's the funny one, the ditzy one, the mean one. What one are you? I think I'm the cold one. A <laughs> cold one? I didn't mean to, but I'm a little bit more reserved. I think I was just nervous. It's yeah. It's intense, but I, I, I warm up. And I'm also, the cold one. I think that's, <laughs> that's funny. I know, but I think I actually get more vulnerable. I cry. She I laugh. does. I do everything you think I wouldn't do. Now, let me ask you, yeah. why did you say yes? I know Andy's very convincing, but aside yeah. from the charm, I, what made you say yes? I think two this? things. I think that the franchise has been really beloved. It feels like a part yeah. of New York. I remember when it first came out, and I was so excited about it. And what I loved was that this time they were bringing on a totally different group. This was not about, like, doing what they've done before. When I spoke, one person in. Yeah, yeah. It, it felt like it was a total yeah. change-up, and the cast is very diverse in age, in ethnicity, in look and feel and style and personality. And that, to me, was a big game-changer in terms of the way that the show... So, Andy, when you are choosing... do you? By the way, are you the guy? Do you go yes, no, yes, There's no? There's a team. I'm on it. And mm -hmm. it's a great team. And we've been doing it for a, a while. And in doing it... you know, Look, we wanted everything that Jenna said. We also wanted a group. I think when you watch yeah. the show uh, on Sunday night on Bravo and then Peacock, when it premieres, you're going to see a cohesive group. And and I think it was a, you know, bringing out a new group yeah. of Real Housewives of New York. It was a tough thing to reboot, mm -hmm. but we did it, and the group is really something else. I just remembered suddenly something Kathy Lee said to me a long time ago. She said, it's "Can I have more wine?" <laughs> she said, she, "Can I have?" She said, "More wine." She said, "It's not about you being a great personality or you." She used to say this about me and her. She said, "It's always about what's in between. Yes, it's about the space yes. in between, it's so and that's true. that's what." So, what is the what's the vibe like I of the house? I think the thing that I found most interesting is that you go into it thinking you know someone. And what happens is you very clearly see quickly that you don't know people. Yeah. And what you assume and what you expect are not what you find. What's also interesting is that Jenna now is seeing the episodes yes. for the first time. And so she's now seeing what her friends oh, said about her oh, about behind you. her back. Do you still like them? Yes. Some of them? Okay, wait. Now, all these celebs love watching The Housewives. Yes. We recently had John, John Hamm on yes. our show. My St. Louis brother. I love John He Hamm. loves you. But let's take a look at what he said about The Housewives. So I read something very interesting about you this morning, John Hamm, and it surprised me, to okay. be honest. I heard that you like the Real Housewives franchise. Is that Brother. a fact, or is that faux news? No, that's, that's, that's real. It's a real? I would, I would say yes. I've been, I've been... Which in, ones in are you into? Well, I'm, 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 I'm a Jersey man. I'm a Vanderpumper. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a Beverly Hillsian. Oh my. I like New York. We'll see what this whole new New York thing yeah, is all about. You know. Okay. That's right. Yeah, John Hamm's up for the ride. By the way, so many celebs come on your show and talk about talk about this. Who's yeah. like the biggest celeb who watches The Housewives? Well, I think I, I mean Rihanna's fandom mm -hmm. of Bravo and The Housewives is the thing that still kind of blows me away. I mean, she's. I mean, listen, I'm <laughs> shocked, but also Jennifer Lawrence, another one yes. I would not have expected. And I think Michelle Obama said that she watches. Yes. Yes, yeah, she dabbles. She dabbles. Yes, Andy, she's in Jenna. the Potomac. <laughs> okay, I know. we can't wait. By the way, catch the season premiere of The Real Houses of New York City, Sunday night, 9 p.m. Eastern, on our sister network, Bravo. And as Andy pointed out so well, streaming on Peacock. Yes, We love Hodes. you, Andy. Love you. 
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.